Brianna in the sense that you can just blind pick it. It's just one of those champions that doesn't matter what you're playing across from, you should just pick it safely. It's, it's got the de uh, defense, and a lot of that goes with the itemization changes. Um, the fact that he can sure, swing. It looks like Juve's just getting to work on the minions, making sure that Thaldrin has to focus on getting his own CS. They're going to be going for the dive. Six is there. Subjugate goes down to get a little bit more tanky from Thaldrin, but Juve in a bad spot here as the final touches are they coming down? And Ambition in, Arctic Assault to come out, gets the W, may not need to queue in, the auto comes in for first blood. Just ambition says Wani. Clinical there. By Frozen walking up. Now, how much does it just work when Korea puts something in action? Thaldron's already in a bad spot as he stayed at the turret, and they are able to still walk that up. Frozen. More just members than Korea has, or just let it fall? A little more ambitious as well in front of the turret. Frozen, very, very low. Goes down himself. Still made one last shot. Faker gets the double kill in. Gets himself out of turret range along with ambition. Start roaming around and assisting that bot lane. So, classic Prey and Gorilla. They held tight, and now it's time for the rest of the team to move on down and pick him up. Causing Europe to put the rally cap in. It's for Prey. And there's also a very deep teleport ward if Cube wants to use it. Oh, Faker trying to roam more power. What an influx of gold as well. One turret after the other. They haven't even been back to spend this money yet. And they are just floating in gold right now. They'll be back to do that. If they actually get that Rift Herald into Turkey's base at this point. One last hit of vision. Almost. And by breaking the outer tower so early, if Rift Herald does freeze, if it goes to an ambition, possibly they want to use it more so in the mid lane. And it is actually yeah. ambition that's going to pick it up. Entire so. team, it is not looking good for your opponents. Korea now starting to clear out the wards as well, throwing a little wide left, blows the glacial prison, and now they're trying to save Zaitnot. He gets himself to the back of the line. Stone Mage is into the back as well as Faker gets himself the safety. Thaldrin's in, and the middle of the fight gets the bullet time as Bastion really doesn't hit anyone with a follow up dazzle. Faker and the team looking to realm warp forward so they can get to the back line. They've done such a great job of protecting Zaitnot and Frozen. Teleport Ash, throw an arrow down middle. Teleport to the turret and kill the guy when he gets. What a beautiful disengage from Turkey, denying a lot of damage. Can they deny the turret though? They throw out the Maokai ultimate. Don't believe it's going to do too much. Korea wants to fight right through it. They find Stone Mage. He goes down immediately. Oh. Zergsting brings Sight Knot back, and Thaldrin is left to try and walk out of this, but they cut the tree down. Eight to one is two more picked up by the Road Korean Zone offense. defense for Turkey here. Baker in a bad spot, takes a little preliminary damage to start off the fight as Frozen sets up the orbs, but he doesn't have an ult. He still gets a scout of the week, takes down Thaldrin. Rather, that was the team, I'm sorry, that was Ambition. And now they're gonna be continuing the fight. Zergstein gets himself back, thought he would live, but Baker is able to take him out that time. And now it is Zeitnot. He does not have Zergstein, and he goes down without the protection. Korea is finally starting to pick Turkey apart in these fights instead of one by one. Frey get a little too greedy. And he's gonna be doing that until he comes back up to hope it doesn't happen Go again. Baker. They're going. <laughs> Still mate, little ambitious, I like it. A lot of job of clearing that out and saying we need breathing room so we can at least take a few fights before they're in our base. Yeah, and the priority lanes for Korea, of course, again. He's lying to us. Oh, Still Mage goes in, finds Prey on the backside. Arrow is gonna hit Gorilla on the front though, as the Cosmic Radiance comes down. Korean All-Stars are able to deliver the damage back to Turkey, and now they're onto the inhibitor turrets and the inhibitor inside Turkey's base. That was just beautiful. The fact that the Cosmic Radiance hits just as Prey is using the ultimate. So yes, it was used reactionary to Jarvan trying to go for the engagement, but all of the damage was front-loaded as Korea are just running through them. 25 minutes on the clock, turning the Turkish All-Stars base into shambles. The Korean All-Stars will look for the last bit of damage on the Nexus as Faker goes down on his rise for the first time in the game, and that is going to be Korea at 2-1. A 